welcome back to this channel today we are gonna convert feet into centimeter right okay to convert feet into centimeter we'll adopt three step right so let me show you the three step before showing you the three step let me take a specific example so we are we are going to convert 10 feet 10 feet into centimeter right because without specific uh, example it is not possible to show you right okay so we are gonna uh, convert feet into centimeter and specifically we are taking 10 feet into centimeter right so to convert 10 feet into centimeter in the first step what will i do in the first step i will search for equivalence and that we need to memorize unfortunately there is no direct equivalence between feet and centimeter so if there is no direct relationship between the units then uh, you have to look for another uh, unit uh, you have to look for the relationship with another unit with feet you have the relationship of ins right and then with ins you have to relationship with uh, with feet you have the relationship with inch and with inch you have the relationship of centimeter so at first you have to convert feet into inch then you have to convert inch to centimeter then you will get feet into centimeter so let me show you the process so that you can understand these things clearly right okay so in the first step what we are doing we are going to search for equivalence right so we know that there is no direct relationship between feet and centimeter but we know that feet is greater than in so one feet we can write this feet like feet right one feet equal to 12 inches inches we can write inches as inch that is one feet equal to 12 inches and then we have relationship inch with centimeter that is inch is greater than centimeter one inch equal to equal to 2.54 centimeter and we need to memorize this type of equivalence to convert for conversion right from one unit to another so we are getting here two equivalence in the second step what will i do in the second step I will I will write conversion factor from these two equivalence from one equivalence we will get two conversion factor and from two equivalence we will get easily two conversion factor so let me write the conversion factor first so from this relation we have inch and feet so I can take inch I can take inch as a numerator then feet as a denominator right and this you will be equal to one so and now i have to write the number associated with inch and feet with inch we have 12 and with feet we have one and with from this equivalence we can take okay let me write another uh, another equivalence from from the first equivalence so just i will take opposite of this so one feet one feet divided by 12 inches equal to one that is from uh, equivalence one we are getting two conversion factor so from here one inch equal 2.5 per center will get also two conversion factor right so if i take centimeter then inch here i will take inch then centimeter right and both will be equal to one and here you, we have just write to the number associated with them with centimeter we have 2.54 and with inch we have just one with inch we have one and with centimeter we have 2.54 right so 
from this equivalence we are getting two factor but we'll use one factor according to our need and same explanation is applicable for this that is uh, between these two conversion factor will use just one but we need not memorize this conversion factor we need to memorize just equivalence this conversion factor will come automatically i will show you in the later of this video right so let me since this is not necessary to memorize so we can uh, we can delete the conversion factor because it will come automatically right it will come automatically so after conversion factor what i'll do in the third step i would like to give you some basic right okay look at this basic given unit times right given unit times look at here desired unit d e s i r e d desired unit divided by given unit given unit so look at here this this given unit and this given unit will cancel out and you will get your desired unit you need to you need not memorize this this will come automatically so what i'll do i will i will delete this right it will come automatically let me show you so would like to convert 10 sorry 10 feet right 10 feet into centimeter so i will write here 10 feet right and then i will try to ex express it as a frank fraction so this doesn't uh, this one doesn't have any meaning actually right and then i have to write conversion factor so there is no direct relationship between feet and centimeter but with feet we have the relationship of inch look at this uh, relationship with inch so we need to convert feet to inch at first so we need to cancel feet so i'll to cancel feet i have to write feet here so that so that i can cancel here and i i will write inch right here so feet and inch which equivalence will be applicable this e equivalence with inch we have number 12 so i have to write 12 and with feet we have one so i have to write one so here already we have converted 10 feet into inch so this is now this is inch right now what i'll do i will take another conversion factor right another conversion factor now my target is to uh, cancel inches and to convert centimeter so there is a direct relationship between centimeter and inch so to to delete uh, so to delete inch i have to take here inch right so with inch we have the relationship of centimeter so look at this uh, look at this uh, equivalence with inch we have the number one and with centimeter we have the number 2.54 2.54 now you have converted 10 feet into centimeter so you are getting 10 times 12 times 2.54 centimeter that is 10 feet equal to this now you need to multiply the this number by your comp uh, by your calculator so let me uh, show you the calculation so we are getting here 304.8 centimeter that is 10 feet equal to 304.8 centimeter so thank you for viewing this video be well but at last i would like to say you that feet is greater than inch and inch is greater than centimeter you need to remember this one feet equal to 12 inch and one inch equal to 2.54 centimeter if you know the equivalence then it is not a difficult task to go from one unit to another so thank you for viewing this video be well 
this is the real method i want to tell you